Welcome back guys, this is Gulliver, he's a male jaguar, and this is Naya, she's a female jaguar. The difference in colour between Naya and Gulliver is a phenomenon called melanism, which is a dark excess of pig, uh, pigmentation. If you look closely with Naya, you'll actually st see that she's still kept her characteristic spots, they don't span out because of the colour. Uh, the couple have two cubs and back in December 2019 they had twins and um, they both look like their father with the lighter uh, coat colour but um, the Jaguar itself is the largest cat in the Americas and the third largest in the world after the tiger and of course the lion uh, within its range at the, uh, the animal is the top of the food chain and they can live in habitats as diverse as the Amazon rainforest all the way down to the dry steppes of south, southern South America. In the wild it feeds on a variety of pay, uh, prey from fish to large mammals and even small alligators. In addition it's known also to have the strongest jaws of any big cat, but their bite force is around 1500 pounds per square inch whereby a lion is about 1050, 1200 and then the tiger coming in around that as well. They can breed any time they want during the year and the mother is usually pregnant for about 100 days after the female children when the female gives birth she'll give birth to about two or four litters or sorry two or four cubs and the mother will continuously feed her young until they're about a year old and then she hangs around with them uh, for an additional year in the world Although commercial hunting for jaguars for their skins has uh, decreased dramatically since the 1970s, like with all the, the you know anti four ads and anti four campaigns and progressive controls and closures of international markets, unfortunately for some reason there's still a demand for their paws, teeth, and other products. So they are on the endangered list. Going back to you guys, jaguars love the water, like tigers. They love, they love to swim. It helps keep the mosquitoes off them, unlike most of the other big cats that don't like water. Another fact for you guys, 11% of all big cats actually have the melanin uh, gene, which means 11% of all big cats can actually be dark, darker skin, such as uh, black leopards, it would be another one. Guys, thank you very much for watching. If you want more videos on Jaguars, please leave a comment down below and let me know because I have so much more information on Jaguars. Again, thanks very much and I'll see you in the next one, guys.